Hey, hey, Twitch! Canesville Gamer here. Back with uh, another short playthrough, probably get an hour in today, of uh, Hogwarts Legacy. Uh, so, <laughs> I said I was going to play for about an hour the other day, and uh, turned into two hours and 15 minutes. The game is incredible. Uh, if you love Harry Potter, you love open world RPGs, single player games, it's the game for you. Obviously, you can see I've been watching plenty of streams myself. I got all the, the drops from other streams. I do have drops enabled on my stream. So if you're watching this playthrough, um, you'll be able to collect those as well. Uh, so let's load into Cade Calbus. Get any more cozy than Hogsmeade. Right. Yep, so when I left off on this game. Yeah, when I left on this, off on this game, I had just finished up Ollivanders and got my wand. So that was very exciting. So we're here in Hogsmeade. Rebellion! So just continue on here. Let's see. Unless that we're on, I need to visit Tome and Scrolls, J. Pippin's Potions, and the Magic Neep. Just went Ollivanders. It's Tome and Scrolls, right? Yep, Tome and Scrolls. Let's go ahead and hit that up. We're right here next to it. An inquiring mind. Thomas Pardon Brown. me, sir. I'm here for the spellcrafts Professor Weasley ordered. Matilda, student. I thought I might be seeing you soon. I am the proprietor here. Thomas Brown. I take it you've had a conjuring lesson? I'm afraid I haven't yet, sir. Ah, uh, but you will soon enough. Of course it is not without complexity. But that is where my spellcrafts come in. That's certainly something to aspire to, Mr. Brown. I look forward to that day. And I, too, see in it. But I shall let Professor Weasley do the teaching. For now, let's get the spellcrafts you need. A potting table and a potion station, yes? I believe. Good. Nothing like being able to grow your own ingredients and brew what you want, when you want. Let's have a look. Let's look at what we have, shall we? Nothing like finding just the right thing. If you're interested, feel free to take a look around at the rest of my inventory. <laughs> Definitely need some uh, coin to be able to consider any of this other stuff. Am I interested in a dung? poster so there are things that we can sell that one does have a plus five defense let me know if there's now. anything else I can do to help Rebellion. Rebellion. 
sure what I need for that. Lumos. Levioso. Repairer. Accio. Right. Just wanted to come back for that. So I think Pippins is up here to the left. is a bit too... Welcome to J. Pippin's Pushins. Pardon me, sir. Oh, thank goodness. When I heard the bell, I thought you were Miss Lawang. Not that she deigns to come here. Though, I don't believe I've seen your face here before, either. It's my first time in Hogsmeade, actually. Is it really? Well, Parry Pippin at your service. And this is J. Pippin's Potions. Potions for all ailments. <laughs> You'll have read it on the sign, of course, but Grandfather always made me say it in full. <laughs> How may I help you today? You're the student she sent the owl of. I set your things aside immediately. I, is it not the most fascinating art to potion making? Rivals. Are potions really that versatile? They may not be as showy as spell work, but make no mistake, they are just as powerful. As it's your first time in, I should mention that it's not just potion recipes I sell. I also offer ready made drafts for all manner of uses. I, but for now, let's get you those recipes, shall we? What can I do for you today? A wise decision. Feel free to take a look at the rest of my inventory, or come back another time if you're in a rush today. I hope to see you again. Farewell for now. Rebellion. This other stuff is maybe outside. Magic Eep. There. Rebellion. Well, hello there. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the seeds Professor Weasley arranged. Oh, the ditany for the new fifth year. <laughs> I... Merlin's beard. Starting Hogwarts as if... Not at all. I'm choosing to see it all as one big adventure. Well, bravo. Not everyone has the temperament to take things as they come. Name's Timothy Teasdale, by the way. I keep the cart out here because I like a good chat. I suppose not. In addition to seeds, I have plenty of plants. Grow everything myself. My speciality is potion ingredients. Even Pippin purchases from me. 
But what say we get you a package of Dipney seed? Let me guess. You're after something fresh. Do have a look around. Plenty of ingredients to pique your interest, I'd wager. Well, that's everything. Better go and find Sebastian. No one can say I don't keep a stack shelf. Revelio. Meet at Universal is half the size. Akio. Rebellion. Rebellion. I officially have all of my supplies. Excellent. Did you get what you needed for your sister? I did. So I suppose the world is our oyster now. Let's see what else we can get up to.
Damn tough for a first big fight. Goodness, a second troll. Did you two take on a fully grown troll by yourselves? I suppose so. It's all a bit of a blur, to be honest. Merlin's beard. That's Zeke. Are you all right? We are, and we were yeah, glad right to help. The, the I'd say keys. help is a bit of an understatement. Nerve Pain like that. The, the makings of an aura, if you ask me. If you are unharmed, perhaps the two of you wouldn't mind helping me put a few... Of course, officer. Singer. Officer Singer. Repair room. Oh, hello there. A, a moment if you would. I'll go and see what he wants. Revelio. Repairer. Lucky they didn't do more damage. Rebellion. Accio. Rebellion. You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented flu powder. Exactly what I was going for. Oh. 
Rebellion. Mr. Hill was just singing your praises. Hello, sir. I don't believe we've met. Allow me to introduce myself, Augustus Hill, Clothia Extraordinaire. I should like to thank you for your remarkable bravery in fighting those trolls, and not to mention your help restoring Hogsmeade to its rightful state. I was happy to help. Frankly, you deserve an Order of Merlin. But I can offer you something much more useful. I own Gladrag's wizard wear, and among my inventory are some unique items that afford certain protection. And, as I suspect, this won't be your last dane. Thank you, Mr. Hill. That's very generous of you. It's the least I can do. Uh, now, uh, let's try this on for size, shall we? Plenty for your perusal today. Take your time. You won't be disappointed. That's a glad... I expect you have a sharp eye for fashion. I'd say we've earned a butterbeer or two, wouldn't you? I'd say that I agree with you. Perfect. The three broomsticks is... even more battle-worthy items, should you be inclined, you're most welcome to peruse my shop at your leisure. Assuming it isn't utter bedlam in there, you might even meet Serona, the owner. She's a good one to know. Revelio. said you could get to the child when they came to Hogsmeade. That all you needed was a distraction. I gave you a distraction. I just watched a student take down your distraction. Who is this child? What are you not telling me? All you need to know is that if you cannot get to the child, then you have no value to me. Did they see us? I don't think so. What was that goblin doing with Victor Rookwood? Ranrock is working with Rookwood. The goblin from the Daily Prophet. I knew I'd seen him somewhere. Quickly, let's get inside the three broomsticks. It's a treat to see you, Lord Gok. I shall let you know if I hear anything. Thank you, Serona. You be well. Now, what can I... Oh, there's a face I haven't seen before. <laughs> it's my first time here. Welcome. Butterbeer's on me. 
heard about the attack. I shall be looking in on the other shopkeepers and residents shortly. Glad to see you two escaped injury. Thanks to this one. Single-handedly took down a troll. Is that right? Well done. Thanks for this. My pleasure. I will say, <sighs> trolls in Hogsmeade. That's never happened before. Something's not right. The only brutes we usually have to deal with are... <coughs> Not timely. Was that Lodgok I saw leaving just now? <laughs> Your clientele's not what it used to be, Sarona. Not to worry, Victor. Once the two of you leave, the caliber of my clientele will greatly improve. I wouldn't do that if I were you, Theophilus. Come now. No need for theatrics. I'm only here for this one anyway. My friend is enjoying a well-earned butterbeer. Only want a quick word. Perhaps you didn't hear me. I said, my friend is busy. One would think you all had enough bloodshed for one day. Come, the ominous. The three broomsticks isn't what it used to be. Let's take our galleons elsewhere. Can't drink butterbeer forever. Seems you've made an unfortunate enemy. Watch your back. Rookwood and Harlow are worse than any troll you might encounter. Trolls? Ranrock and Rookwood? What are you not telling me? I promise to tell you everything. But it's perhaps best I do that later. And on that note, I think we should head back to the castle. Rebellion. I'm certainly glad Serona was there. Told you she was one of the good ones. I can see that. She didn't seem at all intimidated by Rookwood and Arlo. I think you'll need to tell me why Victor Rookwood has you in his sights. But we can talk later. For the moment, we should return to the castle. Professor Weasley's certain to hear about the troll attack soon if she hasn't already. Don't want to risk another detention for...